team, look at us. We are just powering through this wordpresswealth.com. And I know that there is a lot that you are taking in in this particular course, but believe me, this is essential training and it will be so well worthwhile if you are going to enter into a business of building sites for clients and making additional revenue or taking this on as a full-time project or a full-time business and I want you to be armed with everything that you need to know because you are becoming an expert and your dedication and your commitment um, will see you through to the end and it is well worth it. So in module 30 what are we going to look at? We're going to look at setting a custom background and we have looked at some of these features in module 29 but there is more that we can do. Amazing this platform I just honestly is outstanding. So let's go back to appearances and let's go to background and we are ticking over here very very quickly. Now with the uh, back end of WordPress and here we have a couple of options. At the moment this is a preview of the existing background that we have in our site. Now we can either and let's start from the bottom and work our way to the top. We can change our background color simply by select a color and this here is called the hex value but you can move around and change your colors any way that you want and see the hex value. So how about if we wanted to go with this blue? Let me save changes. Here you is the preview. Let's just go back to our site for a moment. Let's refresh the web browser and see those changes take effect straight away. And here it is. Now, works well for me. I love blue. I love the ocean. Um, ask my children, ask my husband. I, I drive them insane with everything blue. Now, the next thing we could do is we could either select an image and we could cho choose an image from our media library or we could choose a image if we have one on our desktop. So let me choose an image from our media library and let's wait for that to load. Here we go. So let's go with the discussion forum. Let's set that at the background as the background and then we get some additional options here. Now look at that. Now at the moment if we come down here to display options sorry about that just flashing across your screen in our display options we can either position this image to the left center the image or have it to the right so let's leave it at centered for the moment now at the moment what this is doing is it is tiled so if I leave that at fixed and let's save those changes. Let's go back to the site. Let's refresh the web browser and let's have a look to see those changes. Now that definitely is very busy. Would you agree? Yes, I think you would. So let's then make it no repeat and let's make it scroll and let's save those changes again. Let's come back to the site. Let's refresh our web browser and let's have a look at those changes. And look, here is the image here. You can just see it above the top of our 
heading here and still set with the blue background doesn't work now the thing with background images is they will be different in size dependent on the size of the image now this is really about experimenting and playing because depending on the type of image and its size it could cause your page and your site to load slowly making it not really user friendly for the person at the other end visiting your site and this is just about testing so let's uh, toll it vertically and let's save those changes and let's see what happens here with that so let's refresh and let's have a look and see what happens then no still stuck at the top because the image is exceptionally small and you can see it running down the center here so how about if we align it to the right let's save those changes go back to our site refresh our web browser and let's see what happens there there it is simply aligned to the right let's go back and quite obviously if we then simply march that to the left let's have it uh, tile horizontally and let's see what happens there save those changes back to our site refresh our web browser and look it just scrolls along the top there of our as a background image so essentially look there is so much that you can do just with the background image my advice would be let's make it fixed let's save changes one more let's refresh and yes we still have it at the top now look my best advice that I could give you would be again to go to fiverr.com um, on fiverr.com you will find so many graphic artists um, you can read their reviews um, I would suggest that you do get someone to make you a professional custom background image for your site when you are ready and you have built it and you will give them a URL to your site so they can see what it is that you are looking for um, and it's definitely well worth a five dollar investment to have an outstanding background image now look I can simply also remove the background image completely and take it away and just run with the blue that I've chosen save those changes go back to my site refresh my web browser and we are back to having a clean blue background this is the beauty of wordpress.com and the uh, way that you can change anything look and feel and if you don't like it you can simply undo it so team thank you for listening and see you over in module 31 Bye for now.